Hey, many fish. It's still the 20th of October, 2017. And I'm looking at this here because someone sent it to me yesterday to take a look at. And I just put it aside. And I was looking at it a little bit this morning. And there is definitely a story going on here for sure. But the 144, I put, I put this aside for, you know, went to do my thing, went to work. And I came back a while ago and I was checking the headlines. And there was an article up here before that was the fewest jobless claims since 1973 show firm U.S. job market. And, of course, I noticed the orange, right? But check this out. 144 right on the side of the drill <laughs> as well as 911 upside down now go figure that one out okay financial orange 911 there's your 144 and 1973 oddly enough is also 9 11 which is also in here which is also in here and the sevens again. There's your 911 again. 77. Seven. Look at the, these numbers. I mean, how do they come up with these? Since when are they so perfect? 22222. Two, two, two. Crazy. You know what I mean? These here, if you add this up, it's 777. Seven, seven. Over here, you got 777. Seven, seven. It just goes on and on. And, you know, I'm looking at a couple of different uh, financial articles, right? So I'm looking at, uh, where was it? Uh, right here. It's cool again to invest. Americans are giddle, giddy about stocks as Dow Tops 23 posted 6.30 this morning. And again, did you know that the Dow 23,000 is also D406W5, 459, 6511. That's what it is. Trader on the floor, 1899. There's your 23. It goes on and on, folks. Nine. There's your seven again. There's your 911 again. It's just bizarre. Seven. Seriously. I mean, sometimes I get like nailed with stuff like this, but this one, I don't know. To top it all off, I just just before I started making this video here I go to check the stock market and look what it is it's at 23,307 but it's up 144 the S&P is up 911 and the Nasdaq is 33 <laughs> could that be a coincidence absolutely but in my humble opinion I would be extremely cautious with my financial um, affairs right now if I were anyone. I can only speak for myself, but I do not put my trust in pieces of paper issued by men who will, in fact, defraud you. It's just as simple as that. I'm not a negative Nelly, believe me, I'm not. I just know men, okay? So if you don't, if you have assets, I mean, some of us, we don't have to worry too much about that stuff. But I would highly suggest that you pull any wealth that you have out of anything connected to this beast system. And I'd do it quick. That's all. I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. There's your disclaimer. But my spirit is screaming, there's something rotten in Denmark, folks particularly in the financials at the time so please take heed 144 unbelievable seek jesus y'all he is the truth peace and grace to you many fish finally my brethren be strong in the lord and in the power of his might put on the whole armor of god that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore take unto you the whole armor of God, 